right, ladies and gentlemen, it is 2 o'clock, which means it is museum collection break number two, division break. Let's get right on into it. Good luck to everybody. Five, six times. One, two, three, four, five, six times. Seven times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nope, sorry, I'm counting too fast. Eight, nine, ten, and eleven. Alright, it is division break, but I will go over the teams in the divisions real quick here. So Howard H. with the AL East, which is the Yankees, the Red Sox, the Blue Jays, the Rays, and the Orioles. Thomas N. with the AL West, Astros, Angels, Mariners, Rangers, and Athletics. Uh, Sung Yun P. with the NL East, which is... The Nationals, the Mets, the Braves, the Phillies, and the Marlins. Jordan T. with the NL Central. The Cubs, the Brewers, the Cardinals, the Pirates, and the Reds. Kevin C. the AL Central. The Indians, the Twins, the White Sox, the Royals, and the Tigers. And Blair M. the NL West. The Dodgers, the Rockies, the Diamondbacks, the Giants, and the Padres. So there you are. I'll get back to the case. If you want to trade a division, you can. It has yet to happen. So we shall see. Some beautiful cards have been pulled. Hoping that I can catch that magic for everybody in this break. I do not have the vast knowledge of baseball that Alex has, but I do have a cheat sheet with all the divisions and off to the side of me here, so I will be, I'll try to be as quick as I can giving the divisions, but it's not gonna, it's not gonna come as quick as the football breaks do. That I, I just know the football divisions. Alright. So, as all museum collections have been, uh, it's four hits per master box, one of each card below. You get an on-card auto, an autograph relic, a quad relic, or a prime relic. Obviously, the relics or the autos could be replaced by a redemption. I don't think they call out anything. Sometimes the box say, like, hey, look for this. But, nope. All right. Here we go. I love it. One box, four mini boxes, four packs. A lot of opening to get to the middle, which is there. All right. All right, Murphy. Oops, come on. Get this camera focus action here. I don't know why, what's going on here. There we go. All right, try to get it set before we get to the hits. First one is a Francisco Mage out of 2.99 on card auto for the AL Central. There we go. There are frames, which are beautiful. Always nice to see. Now, Mariano Rivera, it's the reproduction sketches. You can get the originals in here. 
That's an AL East card. Hank Aaron. I think that's out of 99. That's an NL East. And a Jason Kipnis. Three color patch. Come on now. Try this again. Ah, there we go. It's out of 35. That's AL Central. a major rookie AL Central again and then a Blake Snell out of 299 that's an AL East it's a dual relic with the auto Wow, all right, how about another major? This one's a blue parallel out of 50. Some nice added bonuses for the AL Central. You're too close, man, all right, come on. There we go, 150. There it is. And then the quad relic of Will Myers out of 99 for the NL West. All right. First box down, nice start. Devere's rookie. Anthony Rizzo out of 50. NL Central. Parallel. That's a nice a pink going down there. Zach Granke out of 10. That's a cool relic. You might not have you might have some of his cards. But you might not have that two color patch combination right there for the NL West. What I want to do real quick. I just want to make sure where was the one rookie card? I want to make sure. Yeah, see? I did. There's an Otani rookie that I went by because I'm not paying attention to the rookies. This was from the first box. I apologize. I just want to go back and highlight. Are there any other rookie cards? Might be the only one. But still, it's a big rookie to miss. I do apologize. That was from that was from the last box there. So there you go, Angels, AL West. Again, I apologize for skipping over that. Yeah, another AL East, Rafael Devers. Camera is, let me see something real quick. A little better, I guess. And then a Jacob deGrom on card auto out of 299 for the NL East. Kyle Schwarber. Another one of those canvas reproduction cards. It's Barry Larkin. It's the NL Central. And then a Dominic Smith rookie triple relic auto out of 149 for the NL East. Last one.
Brian Braun, and then a Carlos Martinez out of 99 Quad Relic. It's got a spaceship action going on right there. That's just my opinion. That's an NL Central card. All right. All right. Now I got it. Box three. frames to be found so we'll keep an eye out Corey Seager and then oh nice out of 35 you got a, a dual relic you got the Conforto on top nice three color patch Cespedes two color patch on the bottom there you go NL East dual relic action never hurt anybody And it's the same team, so I don't have to worry about doing a random, which is awesome for me. <laughs> Chris Sale. There's a Bellinger. And a West repo. And then a J.D. Davis on card rookie auto out of 299. And that's for the AL West. Uh, Daniel Murphy out of 150. NL West base parallel. And nice hit right here. How about a Hoskins? 25. 23 of 25. I'm sorry. Come on. Get that to focus. Nice three color patch in the top corner there. It's a triple relic with the auto. For the Phillies of the NL East. Nice. Nolan Ryan, and a Bryce Harper out of 75 quad relic for the NL East. There's an Ozzy Albies. An L East rookie Braves action right there. Servino and Ralph Field Devers out of 199. Come on. Uh, there we go. Dual relic with the auto. AL East. say his name different every time I say it. Maybe one of the times that I say it, it's correct. Is that the, yep. Noah Syndergaard. Reproduction. NL East. Strasburg. NL East as well. Out of 99 purple. And then a Sunny Gray out of 35 relic. For the AL East.
Babe Ruth out of 150 blue parallel, AL East. And then a Brett Gardner out of 99. little pinstripe action on those quad relics also going to the AL East. Last mini box of this box. Mark McGuire. Nice. How about another Hoskins out of 299? Back to back. Great. Maybe. There we go. 299. For the NL East. Very nice. Moving right along here. I always like the look of museum collection. Major rookie. AL Central. Uh, another Babe Ruth card. And then a Josh Harrison game used memorabilia. It's out of 35. One, two, three, four. Four total colors in this one. There we go, out of 35. NL Central. Nolan Ryan out of 150. AL West. And then a Trey Mancini out of 50. AL East. There's the Otani. Reproduction, AL West action, Javier Baez. And what do we got here? Primary pieces. Two diamond, oh, they're all diamondbacks. Okay, never mind. All diamondback players. Let's try to come back in here. Goldschmidt, Pollock, Granke, and Lamb. And it's out of 75, sorry. I'm looking at the car while I'm trying to get it to focus. Not the best idea. So you got a little pinstripe there and a two-color patch there. Three colors overall. All going. Diamondbacks. I know West. Come on. There we go. It's an Ozzy Smith out of 99 parallel. It's NL Central, and then what we got here? Justin Bohr. There we go. Uh, dual relic with the auto out of 299 NL East. Some of these cards are coming right in focus, and some aren't, but it's all right. We'll work through it. Making some upgrades to our computer, but I feel like we reset the, the settings on the camera. We're actually... They be having a new camera as well. So it's all all good things. Just taking a little extra time to transition than uh, I had originally anticipated. But we're going to get there. Another reproduction canvas, Roberto Clemente. And 
Mile Central. Mike Piazza, Mets card. NL Central, or I mean NL East, I'm sorry, NL East. And then uh, Domingo Santana. The Brewers, right? Yeah, okay. Dual Relic with the auto out of 299. And that's NL Central as well. Another ALB's rookie for the NL East. Tanaka, AL East. And then a Kyle Schwarber quad relic out of 75 for the NL Central. Strasburg. This is cool looking. Out of 25, Chipper Jones. I love it. The black background with the gold auto. Nice touch. NL East. Red parallel. Josh Donaldson out of 50. AL East. There you go. And then, all right, so uh, game used memorabilia, three color patch of Mookie Betts out of 50 for the AL East. Moving right along here. Um, we do have a 230 break of a Hit Parade product. It's probably going to happen a little bit after that. I also have a. Uh, Three personal breaks. Just waiting to hear emails on. Might have a Star Wars comic break. It actually it might actually happen today as well. So a couple things on the docket. There's also a hit parade baseball with a couple spots left. Get that bad boy sold out. Four o'clock. We'll do that. Only two spots left. So. All right. Oh, okay. Weird box here. It's Rivera, right? Yeah, Mariano Rivera, canvas. So that's AL East. I have an auto just stuck in here extra. So I got an Aaron Nola at a 299 extra auto, I'm, I'm assuming. We'll just take what the, what the rest of the box gives us, but that's an NL East card. Then a Hank Aaron, and then I have a relic as well, a Dustin Pedroia quad relic out of 99 for the AL East. So two hits in that. Um, I don't think that happened in the last case. Alex did it. I don't know. It didn't tell me that it did, so it's interesting. The question is, do the other packs have the hits that they should? And then we'll go from there. Uh, we got a Mike Trout out of 99. Purple base parallel for the AL West. And then I have a Gary Sanchez triple relic auto out of uh, 149. And that's for the AL East. It's a very thin pack. Oh, still hidden there. Okay. There's a Strasburg out of 150 for the NL East. And Luis Servino out of 299 for the AL East. So we've got. One, two, we got three autos. So the, an extra auto, which is nice. I wasn't sure. It could have been an extra relic. But three autos. It's a cool box. We'll take extra extra hits all day long. Ozzy Smith and a Nick Castellanos out of 35. Two color patch. Or the AL Central. Oh, that took too long. AL Central, Detroit. I was trying. I was stalling, but it didn't, it didn't work that time. It got silent for a minute. Um, next box. 
garbage is starting to overflow, which is a good thing, means that we've been busy in the lounge. Alright, next four up. See, I got a couple of emails. Uh, if you're watching and you've sent me an email, I haven't checked them yet. I'll check them after this break. There's a Mike Piazza out of 99. NL East. And then a Sean Doolittle out of 149. Triple Relic Auto for the NL East. Sandy Koufax, NL West reproduction, Roger Clemens, and then a Josh Harrison quad out of 75. So you got a quad relic out of 75, two black patches, and then two two color jersey peaches. Or peaches. Jersey pieces right there. That's NL Centra. Javier Baez out of 150, NL Central. Victor Robles, rookie for the NL East. And, oh, sweet, how about a Daryl Strawberry Auto out of 25 for the NL East? There you go. Old school for me, in the terms of baseball, not old school, but still, it's a cool, it's a cool hit. Clint Frazier, AL East rookie. Arnado, top player in the league. Underappreciated, I believe. I don't know if that's correct. I feel like he's under the radar good. Castellanos out of 50, two-color patch. Oh, maybe not. There it is. Okay. And that's the AL Central. That's out of 50. So we, that's back-to-back. -back. Well, one was out of 35 and one is out of 50. Back to back boxes, the Detroit hit. Four boxes left here. And like I said, if you're tuning in for the 2.30 hit parade break, it will happen and it's just gonna happen a, little, a tad bit late. It'll be right after this. I scheduled a half hour for her museum collection and I was off. I should have known, I don't know why I thought it was gonna take a half hour. It's okay. All good. Gives you some extra time to get a drink. There's an uh, Otani rookie for the AL West. Freddie Freeman. And then a Miguel Cabrera out of 75. Quad Relic. There we go. There you go. AL Central again. Ryan Braun out of 150 for the NL Central. And this is, oh, wow. That's a beaut. How about a Gary Sheffield, 4 or 5? Yeah, I went, oh, wow. I don't do a lot of baseball breaks. Usually Alex does. So stuff like this, this is fun stuff for me. Three-color patch. That's awesome. AL East. Cool hit. It's low number. It's the Yankees. Like them or not. I mean, that's just team. That's really cool. I like that. Like I said, I don't, I don't do a whole lot of baseball. Personally, myself. So, things like that are a joy to pull and hold live. I think I got a redemption. I did get a redemption. Here comes the encyclopedia, so I'll be able to help me on oh, this. Oh, that's me. Bo Jackson... Oh, I don't need help. Wow. So you George Brett 
okay? So that's huge. That's why I'm overreacting. No, I'm not. AL Central. I have a triple auto. Reggie Jackson, oh, Derek Jeter, Aaron on. Judge. Come the on. JJJ. The Yanks. The AL East. Loser. The Yanks killed it because I just pulled this Gary, Shelf Gary Sheffield 4 of 5 oh. three-color patch auto. And then we just backed it up with a Jackson, oh, Jeter, Judge. I'm assuming that's all Yankee. There's no that's way they would have. There's no way they no, would have. Yes. Yeah. They had that in, um, in Heritage and Auto. I mean, it would be weird if Reggie Jackson was not on the Yankees with Derek Jeter. I know. No, I know. I mean. Wow. This, bo yeah. this box is fire. Absolute fire on this box. And then... And a Mookie Betts, AL East, and then, yeah, all right, Scherzer and Strasburg. <laughs> Three color patch, two color, four colors overall, and that's the NL East. What did you mean before? Uh, I said there was a redemption. I said if it was something I didn't oh. know, you were just walking in perfect time, just in case. But then I saw it, and I was like, nope. I think I got this one. Wow. That was a Yankees box right there. But it's division, so the AL East reaps the sweet, sweet rewards of that. Ernie Banks, and then a Robinson Cano quad relic out of 99. AL West, three colors overall on that. You want to get an instant pickup of this, of those? Same box. Wow. Same box love right there. Same box. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. <laughs> Chris Sale out of 150. AL East. And then a Sterling Marte. I love the camo hits. That's out of 299. Dual relic with the auto. That's an NL Central. Three colors overall on that one. And like I said, we're going to finish this up. Be a little late. And then we're going to jump right into the Hit Parade football break. That was scheduled for 230. Like I said, you got a little extra time before we start that. And there's a Ricky Henderson. AL West. Edwin Encarnacion. And then an Andre Dawson out of 299. That's the Expos, which would be Washington, which gets us to the NL East. Love his autograph. Always, it's always nice to look at. There's certain autographs that just look better. Not, not even. I'm not even counting the player. Just the autograph itself looks nicer. There's a Hosmer, and then a Kyle Seeger out of 25. Another low numbered hit, and that's for the AL West. 25, two colors, good stuff. All right. Two boxes left here. Let's start. We'll go here. We'll end on the box to the right. So no frame yet, but uh, we did hit uh, a beautiful triple auto. And the relic out of five, so not sure what, if anything else, will be bestowed upon this case. But there's only one way to find out. There's a Hoskins. Oh, that's right. We had two Hoskins, too. Can I tell you about that? Did you? Yeah, I had a Hoskins auto, and then the next pack was a Relic auto. Chris Bryant. And then we have Rosario, Sano, Buxton, and Maurer out of 99. AL Central Quad Relic. A 
There's a uh, Jeter himself right there. There's Kluber. Oh, that's a cool looking card. Matt Carpenter, dual relic auto out of 25. Nice three color patch on the bottom. Let's go into the NL Central. That's true. Here's an interesting one. Just a football autograph. Taiwan Taylor. His autograph is awesome. I love the way his autograph looks. He was just saying the older guy's autos are better because they don't have a million things to sign. But his autograph, Taiwan Taylor, he's a wide receiver for the Titans. Derek Henry's got one good one, too. They just, his auto is just really cool looking every time you look at it. Johnny Bunch. And a Paul DeJong out of 299 to the NL Central. Back to back Cardinal sets right there. All right, we're we're coming to the end here. Winding down. Adam Jones out of fifty. AL East, and then a Jason Hayward out of twenty-five. Three color patch. NL Central. This was cool looking. Oh yeah, your yeah, your case killed mine. I'm proud of you. Huh. Usually I get way better cases than you. Do you? Yeah, it's 100% fact. It's not, but okay. I mean, I think it is. I didn't know if you wanted pictures of that or... I don't want you to be jealous. I do feel bad that I pulled the Yankees and you didn't. I know. Oh, it's Nice hit. I wonder what those are numbered out of. Do we have a... I can take a look. Well, it's a base triple, I would assume. It doesn't say anything special on it. just says triple auto, so... Frank Thomas and Nomar Mazara out of 50. Dual relic with the auto. Texas with a dollar sign, AO West. Corey Seeger out of 150, the NL West, and a Gurel quad relic out of 25. Three colors overall. Uh, these are numbered out of five. Holy shnikes. That's an AL West. The triple autos are out of five? They're only out of five. Wow. That is an out of fiver right there. Out of fiver. That, that's probably the best baseball card I pulled individually. Because you, you got the Babe Ruth. You opened the Babe Ruth. That's me. So, I was here. I saw it. But, oh, hey. Look at that. A frame. So we are oh, getting a frame on top of it. Frame? It does look... You got a black Those look black. Clemente. Oh, 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 Adrian Beltre out of five. Fire case right here. Why not? That's the kicker. Unreal. Just some fun stuff that happened. That's my personal favorite. Just because I grew up with TBS. The Chipper Jones auto. I'm going to show that again. All right. So... There's a Babe Ruth reproduction. Tanaka out of 99. So back to back Yankee cards, at least. And then a Billy Hamilton out of 50. And I'll central. And then that is our case. Just a, a quick a quick little recap here. This is my personal favorite just because I like the way the, the black border or the black background looks there's a chipper jones that's not coming into focus at all 
So we're going to take it out. We're going to bring it back in. Apparently, we're going to have to do it back there. There we go. The Hoskins. This is a cool patch. The Granky. There was a Granky patch, too, that I don't have readily available with the pink. The Bell Tray out of five. Can't go wrong. Can't go wrong with this. And don't forget, right after that was pulled in the same box, that bad boy. So two out of five Yankee hits in one box. Amazing. Loaded. Just like the Yankees are usually, right? That's what people say. All right. So there we go. Um, give us a couple minutes. We need to clean up, and then we will be back with more breaks. Thanks.